All right, students, we are gonna go over the symbolic sketchbook cover drawing in this video. So title your page, Symbolic Sketchbook Cover. We're gonna start by listing out some symbols that we can use in our design. You need to make a list of at least five symbols and three of those need to be in your design. You're gonna sketch them first and then explain what they represent. So you can see in mine, I have a globe that shows I enjoy traveling, which I haven't been able to do much of. Secondly, some plants. I love being outside. My third symbol is paintbrush and a palette. Of course, art. My fourth one is a crab. Um, I was born and raised in Maryland. My fifth one, I used a cross to show um, my faith in Jesus. And the last one that I used is a mug of coffee um, to show that I love coffee and just head into cool little coffee shops. Once you've listed your symbols, draw two different ideas for your cover. Remember to include at least three of your symbols in the designs. You can definitely include more, but you don't have to include more than three. Your designs can be vertical or horizontal. Both of mine are vertical. Uh, that's just how I like to design my front cover. So as you're sketching, I don't feel like it has to be perfect. Um, I wasn't looking at any images to help me get the globe accurate, um, but it's just a plan. So don't worry too much if your rough draft isn't perfect. It's just giving you an idea of where you're going to place your symbols on the front cover. It does help if you spend more time on your rough draft and makes the final go smoother but don't be a perfectionist about it. You can see on this one, um, I had a few notes or questions for my critic, um, areas that I just wasn't unsure, of, wasn't sure of, like the background, I didn't really know what to do with it. So I left some notes to get a little bit of help. On my second one, I honestly like this design better than my first which is good, um, kind of have a final design that I will use once I finish up that one. Please take your time. Like I did say earlier, the more you plan now, the easier it will be on the final. Just don't try and make it perfect. These are just rough sketches. Um, you'll see after I draw these leaves that I have a new symbol that was not included in my list. It was a passport. So it still tells the viewer that I enjoy traveling. It's just a different idea than the globe. Um, again, I added a few notes to my critic about maybe the above view, is that good? Um, how can I tie in paint in there somewhere? What suggestions do you have? So take your time, work on those rough drafts, and add questions for your critic in the notes.